Some students from Jackson Middle School are taking part in a unique leadership lesson. They are taking four leadership classes in a four-week span, and Eric Nelson pays a visit to Fort Snelling Base Camp. Make sure it stays. Hey. It looks fine. Hey. If you want to change people, you can't be like a dictator and like yell at them to do that. You have to support them when they do that, like guide them. They are future leaders who will mold and shape tomorrow's world. They are Jackson Middle School students. We should put a marshmallow on the top, guys. Who are learning to listen and to lead at this Fort Snelling base camp. Not every student is going to be on the student council or even go to college. Um, but you can show leadership in your community. Leadership's about you and how you affect other people, not just yourself personally. Through classroom interactive and physical activities, the kids are learning the values of teamwork, which can foster leadership. I think those things go hand in hand. You know, without a strong team, you're just an individual. The goal of this pilot program is to create future leaders in many different capacities. It's not so much that we all are going to be CEOs of companies, but yet we're going to be leaders within our community. We're going to be leaders within our household. You know, how, how do you manage a family? Being a leader in your life is important whether or not you're going to become the president or go into politics or not. The base camp is also promoting unity which is very necessary in these polarizing times. What we're planning on doing this year is pairing people up with someone that they're not comfortable with, that they don't know, so we can get comfortable with people of all different ages and ethnicities and a whole bunch of different backgrounds. At the Fort Snelling Base Camp, I'm Eric Nelson, Channel 12 News. The base camp is owned by the Northern Star Council and run by the Boy Scouts of America.